The following OS update video is strictly for LE models of Kurzweil, does not apply to the PC3X or PC3K. First go to our website, kurzweil.com, click on the top tab that says downloads. This will pull up a page of all our products. I'm using the PC3 LE7. Now in the middle there, I'm going to go to where it says OS updates. I'm going to click on update version 2.02. .02. Now after I hit OK, it's going to download that zip file. When it's done, I'm going to open up that zip file. And within this, I have the files I need to update the LE. I have a PDF of the owner's manual. And I also have written instructions that go along with this video step by step that you can follow along with. Now within this zip file, what I want to click and drag into my thumb drive that's going to go into the Kurzweil is the .kbb, the .ple, and the .bin files. Now the kbb is simply the Kurzweil boot block. The .ple file is both the object extension and the extension given to any other object file generated on an LE. The .bin file is simply a binary executable file. So I'm going to highlight those three. I'm going to click and drag it into my thumb drive. After I'm done doing that, I'm going to safely eject the USB thumb drive by hitting the eject icon. I'm going to plug that thumb drive now into the storage port in the back of the Kurzweil. I'm going to turn on the unit while I hold down the exit button. Holding down the exit button is going to launch me into the bootloader mode. And this is what we'll see. First, I'm going to go to Update Image. It's going to ask me to select a module to update. I'm going to go to Loader Image. Of course, our type here is a USB device. It's looking for that Kurzweil boot block, so I'm going to let it download that. And after that's done installing itself, I'm actually going to power the unit off and turn it back on again while I hold down that exit button. Launch me into the bootloader again. This time, I'm going to go to File Utilities. Now here it's asking me to format the flash. What this is going to do is it's going to wipe the whole unit clean. So it's very, very crucial at this point, to, before this point, to save anything that you've made on the unit. Because it's going to wipe everything clean. I'm going to let it do that. I'm going to hit OK. And after it's done formatting the flash, I'm going to power the unit off again. Turning it back on while I hold down the exit button. Going back into the bootloader, Update Image. Again, loader image. Again, USB device. So looking for that Kurzweil boot block once more. I'm going to let that download. I'm gonna, sorry, I'm going to let that install itself. I'm going to update image. Going over to the left to main image. USB device, of course. This time it's looking for a .bin file. I'm going to let it install that. And once the .bin file is done installing itself, I'm going to go over to Update Image. This time I'm going to Main Object, USB Device of course. This time it's looking for a .ple file. I'm going to hit OK. I'm going to hit OK and let that install. And when that's done, I'm ready to hit Run PC3LE. Down here at the bottom, I see version OS 2.02. .02. Depending on what version you're updating, the numbers that you will see may be different. Now I can double check my work here by going to master mode, hitting the soft button that says master 2, and in there it'll give me the OS version that it's running. Again, I was updating 2.02, .02. I see it there in the OS version, it means I did something right. For more help and support, please email support at kurzweil.com.